I'm a firm believer in having a vision. If you visualize it, then you can achieve it. I was just turned 16. My brother had joined the parachute regiment and he was about to go out into Iraq. And I thought, do you know what? I'm fit, why don't I do that? I'd filled out an application form. Um, we had to do a mile and a half run, a bit of physical test. I beat every single person there. This was sort of the, the green light, I was good to go. My path was clear and everything was set out in front of me. That all took a, a big tumble because in uh, July 1999, I was run over by a 38 tonne articulated lorry. I remember being led in the road. You couldn't really feel anything. The lorry just destroyed me and the rest of my life. I spent years and years with, on crutches. I couldn't walk very far. I couldn't really do anything. All I knew is that I needed to get this leg off because it was causing me so much pain. I was overweight, I was smoking, drinking, went into a bit of a rut. I remember waking up early hours in the morning, putting the telly on, and there was some highlights about the London 2012 Paralympics. And I sat and I wrote a whole piece about how I was gonna do it, how I was gonna achieve it, who I was gonna approach, the way I was gonna go about it, that I needed to get the Andy Lewis back. That was when my vision to become a Paralympian was born. After doing so many swimming sessions, learning to run, learning to ride a bike, having my bike adapted. Everything was in place for me to have a go at my first triathlon. I don't like failure. I don't like having setbacks, so I try and find ways around them and try and find ways over them. But sometimes we have to take risks in our life to move on and to realize what sort of person we are. My goal in Madrid was actually fantastic because that was the turning point, winning European Championships and World Championships, and then go on to win the Paralympic gold medal. So three major titles in one year. What a fantastic year. I then went on in 2017 to win the European and the world title again. But the biggest thing for me was when I collected my MBE, after all the setbacks, the failures, the ups and the downs, everything was absolutely incredible. So I've been working with White in Case now, was my main sponsor, and they've been absolutely instrumental in what I've achieved this year, winning the European and world title and British title. It just works really well, the synergy is there. It's a great partnership. I would have never dreamt of being where I am now when I had that accident. My vision now is to absolutely get to Tokyo 2020, retire, and help other people realize their true potential. Mm -hmm.